check out my shoes. Gross. <laughs> and these don't even come close to the craziness I'm about to show you. Hey, I'm Josh Reimer, and this is The Sassy Scoop, where I review a viral video or share a top 10 list with you. And the eyes might be the window to the soul, but shoes are the window to just about everything else. So, what you choose to put on your feet actually does say something about you. And if you choose to wear any of the 10 pairs that I'm about to show you, it tells me you crazy. You know what's important to me with a pair of shoes? That they're fabulous. <laughs> yes, and that they accent my toes. Oh yeah. Seriously, how would that even be comfortable? That's just creepy. Yeah, I don't want each toe separated like that. What would be the benefit? Why even wear a shoe? Okay, now this is taking it a step even further and not only having the toes separated, but actually having them look like toes. I know, I said the last one was creepy. This one's creepier. Yeah. Okay, now this is more like it. Yeah. If you, if you really want to show off your toes, just draw them on your shoes. Drawn on eyebrows, drawn on toes. Makes sense. Yeah, I might not have painted toenails while you're at it. These ones would let your toes breathe and actually show them off through the teeth, but I feel like they get less and less practical the more outrageous that they get. But like they say, fashion before function, right? Oh yeah, practicality is totally overrated. So 2014. With these ones, the mouths are at least closed, so your feet will actually be enclosed and protected, but your dreams at night won't be. Okay, going back to what I was saying about function, these might be a little too functional. Like, I'm not sure you need a CD player in your shoes, and I'm pretty sure it would skip with every step you took. The real question is, who listens to CDs anymore? No kidding, where's the MP3 shoes? These look like the kind of shoe that somebody in the 80s would have made thinking it looks really futuristic. <laughs> like, that might have looked cool back then, but now it's just like, that ain't the future. And these are what I would think maybe somebody in the 80s thought was like old timey shoes. <laughs> or maybe they actually are, I, I don't really know where they're from. They do have a bit of character, yes. Yes, I wonder if you have to have crooked feet to wear them. No. How dangerous are these shoes? Like seriously, you shouldn't even be allowed to go out in public with shoes like this. Think about pets and children running around. Also, you can just compensate for something else on your body that's too small. Or you could go skiing. Oh yeah. <laughs> these shoes would give you a lot more height and they're not just like a boring black. Like imagine how, how much people would talk about your shoes if you walked around with little fake fish tanks in the heels. Something fishy about this pair of shoes. Who even thinks of stuff like this? Honestly, I would love to spend just two minutes inside their head, but no more than that. Thank you for watching the Sassy Scoop. <laughs> He's got legs. He knows how to use them. Okay, people didn't tune in for this and I didn't sign up for this. Okay, well, I thank you for watching and if you missed either of my last two videos, hey, they're right over there. And I'm going to have a Sassy Sunday. This is what you said last week. I know, but I only lie once a week. Oh, okay. So I guess actually this is another week, so I could be lying again. There's only one way to find out, and that's to tune in on Sunday. So I will see you then. If you're new, make sure you subscribe, because you don't want to miss it. Okay, okay, okay. That chair. <laughs> that chair. And these shoes. Okay, let's go. <laughs> really futuristic. You know what I mean? Like, this is so a shoe. Yes. <laughs> My astute observation. That is... Very true. <laughs> uh, oh, thinking that it looks really futuristic. So it probably looked cool at some point and now it's just, you know, a gray shoe. <laughs> yeah, this is another astute observation. You are on it today, buddy. On it! Man is on fire. You can tell I'm on it? Yeah. Oh. <laughs>